Hey everyone, Emily here. I am a moderator for the Edison Township Amateur Radio Club Forum, but you knew that. And I'm here with my fourth and maybe final vlog because honestly, I don't know what's going to happen after this weekend. But I'm here now and I want to talk to you. So if, if you missed the last radio broadcast, I'll just, I'll give you a super quick recap. So uh, Superlumina is a company that experiments with time travel communication. They, they kind of surprised us by breaking our usual pattern that we've seen in the past. So as early as Friday morning, we were receiving emails that happened at almost the same time that the Mercury process was triggered. And then on top of that, our community, in all our collective wisdom, <laughs> voted pink. So, okay, if you don't know what I'm talking about, that's okay. Uh, it all came to pass, and then on Friday night, before the radio ad was even released, Superlumina website, it went up. So, communication from the future is clearly, clearly a theme here I'm seeing. <laughs> uh, but the, the best part, kind of... The, the biggest thing so far was the, the main puzzle chain that, that the website contained. So we started with a math equation and we got a phone number which led to a voicemail which led to a mission. And then in the mission we were briefed that we needed a community member to go to a physical location in London to receive the next clue. So a, a user, Mool's Mariner, volunteered slash sacrificed themselves to, to make it there on time. They took like almost a one hour train ride and made it and, and met up. I can't believe it. It's so amazing. Uh, I'll give you a little, a little listen here. So we'll do that. 16. 16. Why did you decide on 16? It was the first task code for Waking Titan. Waking Titan. All right. Were there any other answers you considered? There were uh, mm -hmm. Orion, Hyperion, mm -hmm. um, I need to look. You just bear with me. All right. It's been a bit of a rush to get here. I imagine. <laughs> You've come to some trouble. We appreciate that. It's been a long way. Right, it's not that important. Is it not that important? Okay. I, 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 I've got it then. How did you decide on that answer versus all of the other answers? I don't know. I'm part of the community and they needed somebody to come to the job. Why did you trust their decision over your own decision? Why did I trust them? Because we're together. We're a collective. We're work, working together to achieve an end, I think. So is that not epic or what? <laughs> it's amazing. Um, okay, so that was about 48 hours of madness I summed up in maybe two minutes, but you get the picture. Um, to kind of finish off, I, I kind of just want to talk about this, this awesome collective power we have as a community. Like any problem we face, any obstacle we've encountered, we've we've really handled it together. Like there's just nothing that we can't do as a community. So I just want to give a shout out to like the, the Reddit community, the No Man's Sky Discord, Game Detective Discord, and the Battlefield Easter Egg community. Like really, we are insane the amount of power we have when we work together. It's just kind of beautiful to, to see. Um, oh, a little fun fact, or fun for me at least. <laughs> I've been kind of digging into the stats a bit more, and between eTARC and eTARC Forum, we're getting traffic from 180 unique websites. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, but back to the topic of how awesome we are. <laughs> I want to give a quick shout out to Dwarf Taco, who, and like, I know we, we really do work all together, but this guy, like, 
nailed the last riddle in record time. I just, my hands go down to you, sir. Like, that is amazing. Congrats to you. Um, okay, so, so here we are, and we're kind of left. Like, we still have a ton of unsolved glyphs, but we only have one radio ad left. And... On, and it's on Howard Stern, no less. <laughs> like, I think that's going to be like seriously confusing for the normal listeners. I can tell you that. Um, but yeah, so so that's kind of where we are. We have this last this last radio ad on Howard Stern, and I really hope that this isn't the last vlog. I I really want to see what's behind that final door, but I don't know what's going to happen. I'm, I'm interested to hear what you think is going to happen. So let me know in the comments. Um, as always, you can reach me on the, on the eTark forum. And I'll see you this weekend. Cheers. <laughs>